Hello, welcome back my YouTube family linguistics and research guideline. Today I am going to discuss a very interesting topic, I mean mentalism in linguistics. Mentalism by Noam Chomsky believes that the human ability for language acquisition and analysis is the result of human evolution. It is this innate language acquisition device that allows any child to acquire any language even with minimal help and no formal teaching. Uh, in linguistics, mentalism is associated both with generative linguistics and with more modern approaches that go under the heading of cognitive linguistics. Mentalist linguistic, linguists try to describe that uh, mental patterns of language or the internalized grammars that underlie linguistic behavior. So there is a difference between uh, behaviorism and mentalism. Behaviorism is based on observation and empirical evidence. On the other hand, mentalism relies on pure beliefs. By contrast, mentalism is a theory based on the perceived power of thought processes learned through experience or through an apprenticeship with an experienced mentalist. So let's go. Uh, meaning, definition and explanation. Meaning, mental patterns of language, the internalized grammars, linguistic behavior, uh, generative linguistics and cognitive linguistics. Definition. Humans are born with an innate and biological capacity to learn language. Noam Chomsky believes that the human ability for language acquisition and analysis is the result of human evolution. Chomsky highlights the importance of deep structure um, or what a speaker subconsciously knows about the grammatical rules of his native language. Chomsky's mentalist approach deals with how the deep structure of an utterance becomes the surface structure. Mentalism in generative grammar. Chomsky's linguistic theory uh, is mentalistic since it is concerned with, the discover with discovering a mental reality underlying actual behavior, uh, you know, competence and performance. The mentalist school, mentalism. Chomsky pointed out that language makes a uh, use of structure dependent operation. Through this, he implies that language consists of double structure, surface structure and deep structure. In order to understand the utterance, uh, the listener has to comprehend both the structures. Creativity in human language. Chomsky says the normal use of language is a creative activity. The creative aspect of uh, normal language is one of the fundamental factors that distinguish human language from any uh, non-system of animal communication. He says humans have freedom to create novel and new utterances that is never used before, yet one can understand it. The behaviorist school, behaviorism, operant conditioning can be summarized thus, stimulus response, reinforcement and repetition. The behaviorist claim that we learn by imitation and association. Language is not merely stringing words together. Language is creative. Six subjects of research within psycholinguistics. Acquisition, production, comprehension, disorder, language and thought, neurocognitive. Language acquisition. Language acquisition is a result of experience, empirical behavioral approach. Language acquisition is a result of social environment, rationalistic, mentalist approach. So, that was the whole story of today's lecture. Thank you very much for listening me uh, and good luck. Bye.